Hello to our fans online. I'm Sunny Hostin. And I'm Rob Nelson with the top stories on this Monday, January 7th. We begin with growing concerns over a major flu outbreak. The flu has now hit 41 states from coast to coast and is still on the move. More than 2,200 people sent to the hospital and of them, 18 children have died. In one Minnesota hospital, some visitors are banned or restricted from certain areas. Patients showing up in the ER are getting immediate treatment without a special test for influenza. President Obama is expected to name his choice for the next defense secretary as early as today. And the nominee is controversial, former Republican Senator Chuck Hagel. He's come under fire for backing efforts to bring Iran to the table for talks on future peace in Afghanistan. Even fellow Republicans disagree with his opinions about Israel and the Mideast. So confirmation hearings could get contentious. A pretrial hearing opens today for Aurora, Colorado movie massacre suspect James Holmes. Holmes is charged with killing 12 people and wounding 70 others. At the week-long hearing, prosecutors will lay out their case and a judge will then decide whether to send the case to trial. However, many legal experts believe the evidence is simply so overwhelming, Holmes will likely accept a plea deal. And doctors have discovered what may be a life-saving use for the impotence drug Viagra. In a study just released this morning by a prominent journal, British researchers discovered the top-selling sexual enhancement drug helped premature babies. In one case, doctors gave the drug to a premature infant with respiratory problems. Within 45 minutes, the baby's breathing problems improved. Researchers point out among the drug's many alternate uses, this case was Remarkable. Wow, save the little kid's life. See? Who knew? The good news about Viagra keeps going up and up. All right, get more news anytime at, a <laughs> at ABC. You you're know it's going to do something. You're so bad. I am I'm an awful influence. Nothing's <laughs> changed in the new year. <laughs> get your news anytime at ABCnews.com. I'm Rob Nelson. And I'm Sunny Hostin. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it.